What's up, you guys? Finally got my shipment <clears throat> after arming the first one. I didn't even receive it because of I couldn't find my company name or whatever. But finally got it, so let's unbox it. I'm waiting quite a while for this. Originally, I was gonna get the 487, but I decided to get this when this came out. It was priced around the same thing. And there were many promotions on it, so I might as well go for it, you know? Here it is. Well, the sludge. Here we are. Four eight ninety. Things are beautiful. Let's check this area. Here we got the box. Wow, this box is much bigger than I thought. Driven by performance. Field by fantasy. We'll see about that. Open it. Two dual link DPI ports, 800 string processors, <coughs> GDR5, and HDMI with 7.1 channel, which I'm never going to use because I don't want to HDMI. HDTV. And this box is pretty close. Oh, we'll present it with the card right away. Make sure you ground yourself before touching any of this stuff. We'll get to the card last. Save the best part for last. So let's see what we get inside the box. This blue brown card box. Anything else in here? Very angle. All right. Here you got your driver disc with some badge. You got six pin to Molex connector. You get two of them. Video composite. HDMI to DBI. Wait, yeah. HDMI to DBI out. Crossfire bridge. VGA to DBI out. Or the other way around. DBI to VGA out. Composite. S video composite. Power to D suit. I guess this is a gift from Sapphire. And you got your user manual. Something in here. Oh, there's more just in there. DVD suite. Which is nice. Alright, let's go check out the car. I think I'll post another video on the overview of it and the installation of it. Massive piece. Never had a dual slot solution card. Oh man, this is massive. Check this baby out. Pretty damn sweet. Pretty damn heavy too. I'm scaring my father, my motherboard. Alright. I'll post an interview on. An overview of the card. Thank you guys.